What's going on YouTube doing another Blu-ray update today is March 6, 2012. What you see right here in front of us, we have Immortals in 3D Blu-ray and the digital copy version. I picked this up because I have a 3D TV, but this movie is starring Henry Cavill and uh, Mickey Rourke. Um, I haven't seen this movie, but I really wanted to pick it up since I have a 3D TV and I mean, I want to say this is a one of the most anticipated movies of 2011, but if you like Greek mythology movies, you should might want to pick this up. If you like 300 or any other movie like that, Clash of the Titans or anything like that, you might want to pick this up. But there also comes a Blu-ray version and a digital copy. I didn't pick that up, but uh, as you see right here on the front, it says over one hour of extra content including alternate beginning and two alternate endings uh on the front cover i really like this front cover i haven't really seen uh too many slip covers like this i don't know if you can see it in the video but it's real shiny it's not a lenticular cover or anything like that but i'm gonna try to show it off to you i mean it's real shiny I, you probably can't really see it in this video but since my lighting is all jacked up but uh oh uh, yeah so I'm going to get straight into this unboxing. I'm going to show you the back here first. Well, the side. It says Immortals in 3D. This is a 20th Century Fox movie. As you see right here on the bottom, it has the Blu-ray 3D logo. I don't know what's going on with Best Buy, but a lot of their slipcovers are getting scratched before you like even buy it. I don't know what's going on with that. Right here on the back... Pretty nice artwork, as you see right here, is the three disc combo pack, which includes the 3D Blu-ray. Uh, basically, the feature film on that one. The second disc is the Blu-ray feature film plus bonus, with all the special features and deleted scenes. And the third disc is the digital copy of the film, which works with iTunes. As you see right here, what you need uh, for this uh, 3D version, you need a 3D compatible TV, uh, 3D glasses, a 3D Blu-ray player, or a PS3 and a high-speed HDMI cable, which you guys probably already know. I'm going to show you right here, just in case if you want to see uh, what's on the disc. Well, it's actually from the producers of 300, so if you like 300, I have the digi book of that, but if you like 300, you might want to pick this up. This movie will run you around... Uh, 22 bucks, so, well, 24, the Blu-ray copy, just plain Blu-ray is 22 bucks, but I picked this for 24 bucks up on uh, Best Buy today, prepare to be amazed, as you see right here, I'm not going to tell you too much about this movie because I haven't seen it either, but I did want to see this, this movie came out in theaters on uh, November 11th, 2011, but uh, here's a side-by-side -side view with the slipcover in the case of the movie. Pretty same artwork. Nothing really different. It's just not the shininess that you would see on the slipcover. It's not on the Blu-ray case. Back-to-back -back view. Pretty same artwork. Just not the photos on the Blu-ray box. Pretty much the same. Uh, this movie, feature film, 1080p, of course, English, DTSD, Monster Audio, all the basic uh, features of a Blu-ray film is here. Let me get into this. I know you guys want to see it. I'm running on four minutes, so let me get into this. See, I gotta cut this off. I usually try to save that on there, but uh, let's see what we got here. Here is the digital copy paper that comes in, in every copy of the movie. Here's a brochure of uh, new movies that are coming to Blu-ray. All right, let's get into this right now. The first disc we have right here is the 3D version of the film. Pretty nice artwork. I'm surprised Fox had uh, artwork on their uh, 
Blu-rays because mainly like Warner Brothers and uh, other companies like that really don't have artwork on their disc. Next up, on the left-hand side, we have the Blu-ray copy. And on the right-hand side, we have the digital copy version. Pretty nice artwork. I'm surprised to see artwork on the digital copy. But uh, I'm going to give you a closer look at the Blu-ray disc. Here's the digital copy. Pretty all-around uh, box they have here. I'm surprised. No artwork inside, but who cares? Pretty nice uh, all-around Blu-ray from Fox. I'm really surprised. I will be doing a update. I do have the metal pack of the Muppets, which is uh, coming out on 3-20-2012. The movie has not come out, but I got the metal pack. For seven bucks, if you buy that Best Buy, uh, you'll be saving, I guess, seven dollars on the Muppets movie. But it will be coming out on uh, 3 20 2012. So you want to pick these up before they're gone. I'll be doing an unboxing of this today. So I'll put a link in the description if you want to watch that. But uh, all around great movie. I really appreciate it. If you comment, like, and subscribe, watch all my other videos, give me thumbs up. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to do my YouTube thing. All right, YouTube, peace.